So where can people go to, if they want to try this out, if they want to get some treatments? Because if you're saying a lot of doctors won't try this out or implement this, where do people go? A lot of times um, it'll be available at uh, physical therapy offices. Uh, sometimes naturopaths are, uh, have adopted this um, because it is, it's such a natural way to, to help the body facilitate healing. Um, but uh, it's kind of hit or miss, honestly. You gotta do your, your research a little bit on, on where to go for, uh, for a pr practitioner and mm -hmm. then you don't know if that practitioner, how well, how well versed they are on, on the device too. And so that's what Cody and I are, are, are working on training good practitioners and consolidating them so that where, so that people can, you know, when they want to go get a, uh, a, a therapy from intelligent microcurrent, they can go to one place and find mm -hmm. that therapy and, and whether they're in Des Moines, Iowa or. Yeah. Cause um, how widespread you know, is it right now? You know, it, it's, I'd say it's kind of a, a West coast thing right now. Um, we are, I believe one of four, um, uh, businesses in the Phoenix area, mm -hmm. uh, or in, in Arizona, there's a few up and down California. Um, but, uh, what, I mean, you really want to come to pain free Institute and, and come get treated by us, uh, and, and have, uh, demonstration sessions and, and, um, show you exactly what this can do uh, with you know, a couple of guys who have used, used the device for a combined 16 years uh, at the highest level of treating um, you know, professional athletes and uh, as well as you know, anybody with, with any kind of ailment, um, we, we help you with your pain. Um, this will alleviate your pain mm -hmm. and uh, it'll do it quickly. Mm -hmm. And um, we have uh, protocols that we've developed from uh, studying alongside incredible scientists and doctors uh, studying this device. And um, we developed some very specific protocols that other distributors have have uh, neglected or overlooked. I was going to say, because you mentioned you want to make sure you go to the right place. So there's, are there, there's places that try this, but they don't do it as well. What right. are they doing wrong if it's so easy to use? Um, well, you know, they can, they, they do give pretty good uh, training, but their follow-up is, is mm. poor sometimes because sometimes, you know, you'll, you'll, have, uh, you'll have a couple days of training and you'll get the basics, but then you'll come along to something where, uh, say they've got uh, plantar fasciitis, which is, you know, uh, tightness, plantar fasciitis. <laughs> it's, uh, it's what a, is that? It, yeah, it's a discomfort at the bottom of your foot. Okay. And um, a lot of times you don't want to go to where it's hurting. That's just the victim. The bad guy might be up the kinetic chain a little I bit. I see. So it's more. It's almost more of a. What well, What would that be? Uh, it's more about more knowledge on the body that you yeah. guys feel like you have than the actual device. Right. What you were telling me earlier about um, the teeth. Like mm -hmm. I didn't know this. How connected the teeth are to other parts of the body, mm -hmm. and that sometimes you guys will go in there to say target something wrong with the hip instead of going straight to the hip. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so that's probably so what Chinese medicine has, uh, and Eastern medicine has been grounded in the fact that the body is insanely connected from all different angles. Um, you have tons of acupressure points in, in your hands, in your feet, in your ear, uh, at the roots of your teeth, uh, and as well as up and down your spine. And, um, by going and treat and treating in these areas, uh, they've mapped it all out, uh, where in the ear, there's uh, you know, a place for your heart. There's a place for your lungs. There's a place for where your elbow is. There's a place where, and, uh, in baby books, you'll actually read that you can give a baby a full body massage by massaging their ears. Really? Yeah, no, this is one of the things you can read in a baby book. And you know, what's so funny is I've noticed that when, um, if I, I'm petting a dog mm -hmm. and I start massaging their ear, they just like, yeah. Yeah. F you know, melt. Yeah. I don't know if that has to do with that. It certainly, it sure does. Yeah. Yeah. Animals are, are very connected mm -hmm. to their ears as well. Um, you know, it's, it's, uh, a point that's really close to your brain and, um, and ears are generally, you know, pretty sensitive and, uh, they're one of the more sensitive parts of your body. And, um, there are just tons and tons of energy, little energy pathways going, starting at your ear and connecting to part, different parts of your body. Yeah. And so with a little tiny bit of 
targeted electrostimulation right on where that lung uh, meridian is or right where the uh, the gallbladder you know yeah. meridian is you can go and help uh, stimulate the gallbladder and, <laughs> and detoxify the gallbladder through your ear you were showing me that chart of the the of again the, the gums and the teeth and yeah. i was like what <laughs> It's yeah. just what every tooth or whatever, or the, the nerves, like what, this one's for the hip, this one's for yeah. the shoulder, whatever. And yeah. I was like, that that's insane. So that's probably what you're talking about when you say like some practitioners, unfortunately, like you want to be careful about who you go to because they need yeah. to know things like this. They need to know things like this. Exactly. Got it. Yeah. And just how important it is to hit the body from multiple different angles with this, with this type of therapy. So that you're getting detoxification through all of these energy pathways and, ner and nerve pathways and really expelling these, these toxins within your body. And then now you're getting, you know, clean cells that, uh, that are replicating proper properly and, um, and you, you know, return those cells to homeostasis. Hey everyone, thanks so much for watching the episode. If you're interested in contributing to the conversation and supporting the show, there's two easy things you can do. One, click subscribe. And two, visit our Patreon page where you get exclusive access to the Exploring Minds community.